Well, a string of air conditioning thefts in Oakland County has forced dozens of people to brave the heat with more than 20 thefts coming from a single townhome complex. Right now, it's unclear what metal the thieves may be after or if it's the units themselves, but it's a trend that police want to stop. 7 Action News reporter Brett Cass tells us how these thieves are doing it and what you can do to try to prevent it. Well, it's been a hot few weeks for dozens of residents at this Oak Park townhome complex who woke up one morning to find their AC units had been cut off from the wall and stolen. AC units have been on full blast across Metro Detroit this summer, but lately at this Oak Park affordable housing complex near Coolidge and 8 Mile, it's been awfully quiet after a noisier Friday night. I was sitting at the dining room table and I kept hearing noise, so I was a little paranoid, and I looked out the window, I didn't see anything. Nearly three weeks ago, Kilana Barbie and her neighbors were just moving in. She says lots of U-Hauls were coming and going, so she figured that late night noise was just a neighbor. They did it at the perfect time, so they knew what they were doing. But turns out someone was actually stealing AC units, cutting 11 of them in the middle of the night. Luckily for Kilana, hers wasn't one of them. I thought I was lucky, I thought I was the lucky one. But I wasn't, they came back and took more. But four nights later, 12 more AC units gone. And this time, Kilana's unit was one of them. Still today, the snipped off wires are all that's left. Thermostat read 94 degrees last week for a couple days. Oak Park police are investigating, but with no witnesses and no video, so far, there are no leads. This is very unusual, especially to have this many units taken. Uh, in that close proximity of time in one particular area. However, there is video just down the road in Ferndale, where police are also investigating a string of air conditioning thefts, including one shown here from Tuesday night, when a U-Haul truck took two AC units from a townhome complex. Police don't know whether or not it's the same group, but they haven't ruled it out. I would venture to guess that there's probably some connection there. In the meantime, police advise getting a cage to protect outdoor AC units as Kilana and her neighbors brave the heat, waiting for a replacement. It's miserable. I think I'm going back to my mom's house tonight. <laughs> now again, despite Coolidge being just right there, police right now have no information, no leads. If you know anything, you're asked to contact Oak Park Police. And if you know anything about the cases in Ferndale, contact Ferndale Police. Reporting in Oak Park, I'm Brett Cast, 7 Action News. All right, Brett, thank you.